I'm Tanya Marie, I use she, her pronouns. Uh, I run an org called Nourish NYC, but I'm also a Colectiva member at Mil Mundos. I'm going to start with the first time we were here two months ago. I remember it was like 20 straight days of protesting, and I got home, and my mom was with me. It was the first time I'd seen my mom in almost a year, and I got home and I cried. I got in the car, actually, and I cried <laughs> with my mom because it was the first time in 20 straight days of protesting that I felt seen, and that I felt like as a black queer woman that my life actually was being cared about, that I was actually reflected in the shit that I fight so hard for every fucking day. So thank you, and thank you to Guanabana for giving me that love and for inviting me back into this space. For those of you who don't know what Nourish NYC is, some people call it a mutual aid org, some people call it a community org. I call it a holistic approach to community care. Um, my goal is to listen, first and foremost, to the people around me and to just see what they need and I hope that we can just continue to transform to meeting those needs as the years come. I'm thinking long term now, this happened by accident. We just turned three months old yesterday. We provide water, snacks, PPE, all that to protests and demonstrations in addition to anybody in need um, who comes up and asks for anything or who will accept it. We offer grants for protesters and organizers and those are gonna be opening up tomorrow. So if you're in need of one, just follow me on IG or stay tuned to our website, which is nourishnyc.org. Um, there's no criteria process, really. It's first come, first serve, black, disabled, trans women to the front. That's it. And we also have an initiative called The Cloud Room that focuses more on educational and arts and spiritual wellness. And so I am launching or relaunching um, the Shea Parsons Therapy Fund. And so again, black trans women to the front. And it's a fund that will be offering $1,500 grants to black trans women and anybody else who needs them, but them to the front. 